Hey, what is going on YouTube? We are here in, of course, Second Galaxy, one of the greatest um, simulation space games Android out space there right station. now, iOS and Android. And you can get the Pride of Titan. No, oh, it looks like an interesting kind of ship. Okay, anyway, so let's get right into this. So I've just joined the new corporation, um, No. So this is an awesome corporation. I highly recommend you join a corporation. And if you are in Second Galaxy, I highly recommend you check out the Null Corporation. All you have to do is type in N-U-L-L, -L and you can find it uh, in the Corporation tab, Dark Null. So yeah, I mean, I'm just checking out this um, awesome chat right here. So there is, you know, what is the benefits of a corporation? Well, you know, there's a lot of benefits which I've read about. The fact is that it gives you a kind of daily allowance and you can use this daily allowance to purchase things in the game. So again, you know, other games don't have this, but other games do. You can join a corporation in-game and you can have all those benefits. All right, so let's get right into this. What is this badge thing? I keep checking this out, but I don't know what it is. Um, it keeps flashing. I don't know what that badge thing is. Gift packs, uh, there's the Pride of Titan again, research bundles. So these are pretty cheap packs. I'm on the, uh, I'm on the, on the Canada side, so I guess it's in Canadian dollars. Um, let's check it out right here. So we do have some operations to go to, we have some messages, second galaxy compensation. You know what, you cannot deny compensation. So we're gonna go click yes on that. Uh, mail attachment, okay, cool. A lot of other messages I have here. So let's check out whether the messages I have. Let's check out here. A lot of messages, a lot, a lot of messages. Okay, and that's it. So, this is the chat. I have no idea how to use any of this. Um, I'm relatively new to the game. Uh, so you do, if you do have any comments, like please leave them in the comments below. So we do have some main plot points to kind of go over. Uh, Let's check out here, overview, main military conference. There is an emergency in Samos, Primus Aleski. You know, this Welcome back, Russian guy or whatever he is. It sounds pretty cool. So, Rashid, okay, let's accept this mission. Okay, so we have to, Remember, there's an emergency in Samos, the Lady Thorns, it's called military loyal. conference. Perfect, so we're gonna take out our new ship, the cavalry ship. It's a pretty awesome ship, built it recently. Um, the cavalry ships. Starting Whoops. <laughs> Discord. I joined the Dark Null Discord. By the way, the Dark Null Discord link is in the uh, description below, so please check that out. Okay, so we have a few jumps to go through, and this is definitely like one of the downsides of the game. Is having to go through all the jump points. So it's definitely worth, uh, you know, I wouldn't get too hung up on the jump points, but they are there for a reason. Starting this game doesn't take too much data, really, which is kind of surprising. You know, I guess like all the graphics are loaded beforehand or something like that. Um, okay, so we're going to. Oh, we've just reached just reached Samos Station. There's almost 500 people here, so there's quite a lot of people uh, in Samos Station and the surrounding solar system. So we're going to go here and we're going to accept uh, this military conference mission. So that shouldn't be too bad. So let's go in here. And we've just entered Samos Entered Space, Space Station. Station. Military conference. This is the mission we're doing right now in the NEF. Yes, go on. Why go on. Yes, argue. Argue galore. Um, okay, just got an encounter probe. Don't know what that's for yet. For orders, I'm sure Lieutenant. we'll soon find out. So I still have a lot of stuff locked here. So we're gonna do this riot mission. So we have to lead an assault team. Why are you here? Transfer the assets. Okay, I'm gonna accept this mission and I can get some sort of missile Go launcher, which is pretty good. Okay, let's take out the cavalry ship. So, let's warp to the next system here. So again, it's really important to kind of complete Starting those pilot licenses. Completing those pilot licenses really does help uh, 
uh, in getting all these new ships. Target location. Um, a lot of ships you can get for free just by completing the missions and other ships I believe you have to pay for. But of course, if your ship is destroyed, I think it is destroyed forever. So you do have to pay a lot of money to, uh, to get those ships back. Okay, so we've just entered the mission area and we have to go to the mining facility. Oh, but there's riot workers. Okay, we have to defeat, destroy the riot workers and transfer the hostages. So we, let's use all of these. Here we go. Those riot workers are going down. That's right. Boom. Eliminate the mob. I like it. Eliminate the mob. So we're going to use all these missile launchers now. I really want to equip better missile launchers. So we just got velocity and defense up. So let's... Um, <laughs> trying to attack the mining facility there. So transferring the hostages and we have to search for other facilities. So there's a second mining facility. So let's check this out. So let's approach the target. Where, where is it going to? Um, so we're approaching the target. Let's do this boost real quick. So some other... So we have to search for other hostages, I believe. So yeah, I mean... Again, as I was saying in earlier videos, the, the UI is pretty complicated. Uh, but there is material out there to read up on if you do get confused about playing Second Galaxy. Target. And if you have played EVE Online, it is kind of very similar. Um, oh boy, let's kill this son of a... <laughs> okay, so that is... Uh, yep, there's a lot of bad language there. I've noticed some of the language in this game isn't um, start out. Which is really weird. Some of it start out, some of it isn't, I guess. Uh, I don't know what they were doing. Okay, let's kill some of these right workers. We're doing a good job here. Good job, guys. Oh, I just noticed my... Anyway, okay, let's kill these right workers. Eliminate the mob. Here we go. Object objectives completed. Two out of three. Transfer hostages, transfer hostages and assets from mining facility. Okay, let's go to the mining facility. Uh, what am I doing here? So we should be going backwards. Approaching target. Perfect. Approaching target. And let's use that boost reel there. So again, as you can see, the blue bar is the energy. So transferring the hostages. Target engaged. Cool. Commander Rashid, hostages have been transferred. <laughs> oh boy. Um, my character's kind of cheeky. Um, okay, it's got some quad. Got a quad S missile launcher. Perfect. What are you doing there? Your mission is complete. See what's happening with the mob. Head back. Report to me now. Why are you here? Wow. Okay, got some S sniper missiles. Not too bad there at all. So we're making our way back now. Commencing warp engine. Starting warp engine. And we're going back to the Samos station here. Do it a good job. And we should be there momentarily now. Going back to the Samos station. And let's see what other things we can do in the Samos station. I mean, I'm kind of interested to see here what else is oh yeah i got those quad s missile launchers perfect Entered so let's check station. out the uh flight report if that pops up oh wait ensign hope you're late uh, blah 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 Why yep prime Saleski, sir yes sir uh prime Saleski. remember my fleet no, no, come loyalty rankings unlocked perfect we've got unlocked a few more things here flight report main plot riot just completed riot we got a warp core cover, so that boosts us a little bit. And the quad S missile launcher, perfect. Rankins, okay, what is this Rankins? Oh, okay, so this is all the Rankins of the entire game. Okay, so I'm definitely not at that stage right now. Definitely not on the Rankins list. Um, I mean, there's a huge lot of people in this game. Like, you know, five, at least 500 in this entire solar system. 500 people, so can you imagine, like, all, all the rest of them in the others? Um, so let's do this riot control mission. 
So I'm going to accept this Why mission, Riot Control, you? level 8 mission. So I'm going to take my Go cavalry ship out now. For orders, and we're going to go to this, uh, to this mission area. Starting warp engine, perfect. Starting warp engine. Commencing warp. Commencing warp. Okay. Arrived at target location. So we're going to do riot control now. So let's see where we are. Gunnery units detected. So I don't know if we have to destroy these target gunnery units. On. Didn't read a lot into. Wow, okay. So avoid engaging the gunnery units because they're shielded. Take down the fire control center possibly. Oh boy, so we don't want them to be charged to 100% because they'll probably take me down. So let's go to the fire control center and let's see what we can do. My shields are already down right now. I do not want this gunnery unit to get to 100%. Shutting down the energy supply. Oh, it's going to cut it close. It's going to cut it close. Phew. Engaged. Okay, that's good. That's good. <laughs> they almost uh, they almost took me out there. Oh no, not more riot laborers. Oh god. Okay. Okay, so we got few armed thugs and riot laborers. So let's defeat these mob. Defeat the mob. Defeat the mob. Here we go. Target locked on. But boy, there's a lot of them. Pine cone. So let's use our missiles here. All these NEF missiles. Putting them to good use. We need to destroy this gunnery unit. It is imperative for the mission. Doing a good job there. Almost defeated them now. Using my special weapon there. Oh wow, that was great. <laughs> destroy the riot laborers. Awesome. All right, now we can destroy the gunnery units. I believe the shield is the shields are now down. Ah, uh, through the through the station right there. So let's try and defeat these gunnery units. Hopefully, they won't be too much of a challenge. I'm trying to take down the shields. Oh man, Un unable to penetrate those shields. Okay, we have to take down the shield supply unit. Alright, where is it? Here it is, the shield supply unit. Let's take that down. Target invincible! Not for much longer. Not for much longer, that's for sure. Alright, so we're taking down this supply shield. Approach the target! Approach the target! <laughs> Approaching target. Okay, here we go. Shutting down the supply shield. Good job. Target engaged. Okay, gunnery unit shield reduced. So we should be able to take down these. Alright, so those shields are now down. And we can begin the assault with the cavalry starship. So let's go in there. Destroy these gunnery units now. Oh, there's quite a lot of people in Samos right now. Over 500 people. I just can't get, I can't wrap my head around how many people are in one solar system. It's absolutely crazy. I guess the entire world right now is playing this game. Okay, defeating the gunnery units. Almost there, perfect. One is destroyed, boom. That's right, going for the second one now. Primary weapon ready. Yeah, you're you're nothing without your shields. <laughs> destroyed. Some critical damage right there. It's going for the third gunnery unit now. It has no chance against my cavalry starship. Taking it out. Boom. Make those scum pay, that's right. Alright, we have new order from the Great Council. 
Oh man. Poor Lisa. She's always shafted. <laughs> um, okay, so what else now? Alright, mission complete. We've got some flash jump engines. Alright, so let's return to the station now. Return into the station and let's see what the next thing is. Obviously, like... <sighs> wow, this is an awesome shot. Of the ship. So we are returning to the station now. We just ent almost entered Samos Station. And we'll see what else we have to go on. There's a lot of people in Samos Station. Just checking this little list here. Octave Richard. Seabrooks. I'm sure I've seen Seabrooks before. Um, okay. So, just entered the headquarters. Samos, Samos Space Station. Oh, flight report. Right control complete. Perfect. Right control is complete. Got a few items there. Um, almost level 11, which is pretty impressive. Almost level 11. Can't complain, really. Um, yeah, no one replied to my message. No problem. Um, obviously, some people are offline right now. So let's check out some of these side missions. A lot of side missions. Um, oh, claim that. Oh, yeah. Some credits. Credits are always a good idea. Um, credits, credits, credits. Alright, Technical Office, Officer Lisa. Um, okay, configuration. Oh yeah, ask? pilot level 11. Alright. Alright, she wants Only us to head into the mall. Click the mall. Yes. Let's see what's here. Oh boy, look at all these. Look out for the wow, I didn't know you could do that. Okay, so there's a bunch of ships here which you can buy. Um, there's the Mist ship, the Frost ship, the Gelma ship, the Lynx, the Lynx, the Jaeger, the Komodo. These are pretty cool ships. Frigate, destroyers, cruisers. Nice, nice. It's, it's always good you can buy the ships for for free in a way. Not for free, but you know what I mean. Um, okay, what what else? Technical Officer Lisa. Anything to ask? Okay, she's Anything running us through ask? some tutorials here. Okay, so she wants us to relocate our base. Only I'm going to click here. I'm going to click victory. on the map. Oh, the map. Yeah, look at this. The solar, the, the whole galaxy. Okay, so that's how to relocate your base. So that's obviously good to know. Maybe I can relocate my base into uh, to where my corporation is located later on um, okay relocation security status what does security status mean I don't know what security status means security high maybe it's kind of like a PvP thing who knows who knows okay so this bunch of things are locked right now so what am I gonna do what are you looking for ensign guide fully perfect Anything device slots okay hi second lieutenant Oh, I've gained a new ship slot. That's awesome. Okay. So I'm going to go to the ship hangar. Only progression and revolution okay, so this is victory. a little bit complicated. Or maybe not. Configuration. Oh, that's really cool. So you can set up pre-configured uh, configurations. Oh, yeah, that'll be awesome. Cargo space, ammunition. So there's a lot of customization right here. So the links, the cavalry... Yeah, so these take up a lot of good stuff. So I'm level 11. So I do have some... Let's take a look here. Pilot attributes. Okay. So what are pilot attributes? Hi, second Attribute lieutenant. points. Anything to ask? Oh boy. All right, level 12. Awesome. Okay, level 12. Looking Let's take a look at attributes. Okay, click here. Oh, interesting. Okay. You'll get free attribute points as your character levels up. It's good to know. Oh boy, look at this. Available attribute points. Current attribute points. Okay, interesting. So, ship. Okay, weapon damage bonus, shield capacity bonus, ship energy capacity bonus, max velocity bonus. So, you. It's good to have good ship piloting for smaller ships, but then you want really good weapons for larger ships. That's my kind of deal, I guess, right there. 
And the, to be honest, like these aren't even going up by one percentage on a point, so... But I guess it does make all the difference. So yeah, I'm going to put more into weapons and more into defense. Um, yeah, please let me know in the comments below if you think I should be putting more into ship piloting and electronics. What is this? Launcher Academy. Different type of prerequisites. Interesting. So it costs credits to train this. So I'm going to go ahead. Okay, I'll do that later on. Um, okay, so what have we got next? Are there any missions for us to do? I hope so. So it wants us to take out the cavalry and check out, of course, the ammunition. Okay, so you can equip different ammunition. So that's always good to know. You kind of want to have the best ammunition on hand to take on in those PvP, PvP battles. So it's always good to know. Um, okay, gonna load this S sniper missile ammunition. Gonna go ahead then click confirm. Um, I think that was confirmed. Okay. Oh, perfect. Claim rewards. Alright, got some recharges. Rivers of blood flowed in the mining area under relentless attacks by the fleet. But the Great Council is not All satisfied right, chapter with four, the commander's peace decision. Talk. We've just reached chapter four. This is awesome. Primus Alesky. Reputation unlocked. Welcome back, my son. The commander definitely doesn't think so. Go on. What were you thinking here? Go on. Go on. Go on. <laughs> Go on. <laughs> okay. Thank you, Alesky. Okay, so we have no access to organizations from each nation. Get started. Remember, the First your... Legion is always loyal. Something. Okay. So, reputation. Okay, so we can earn reputation points. So, this is the list of all factions we can contact. Your reputation rank will allow you to access high leveled agents. Okay. So, can we use these agents for something? Possibly. Interesting. So I guess you can use these guys to do missions for you or something like that. Okay, select ship. Let's undock this ship right now. And let's head out there for this mission. So we're going to, Starting to warp engine. Majestia. Commencing warp. So just exit in Samos now. We have to go to the jump gate. Arrived at target um, location. Yeah, we have to go to the jump gate to, to go to different uh, solar systems. I'm very surprised that you can't just jump to another solar system without using a jump gate. I know you can in Star Trek, I know you can in uh, other sci-fi things, Starting but it's very, very similar to Babylon 5. I'm kind of thinking if they got I'm any ideas from Babylon 5 here. It's kind of my thinking. So we've just reached the jump right, gate in Chios location. right now, and we're going to Majestia, can't even pronounce that right. Boom, just going through the jump gates. Okay. Just entering the jump gate right now. Start in warp. We've just Starting entered the system. Engine. Go into, I assume, the space station. Commencing warp. So again, this is a yellow system. So location. what is the difference between green systems and yellow systems? That is something I'd really like to know. Is it, uh, you know, is yellow kind of like half PvP? Or can anyone attack you in yellow systems? I just don't know. Um, okay, so we just entered the station now. And let's see if we can do this mission. Entered space let's station. take a look, let's take a look here. Okay, we can do research. Let's head on over to... Well, there's some other missions here. No, these are the same missions. Overview. Envoy's Arrival. We can do this mission, I guess. Okay, Reputation. And let's see. Let's click Go. Be a title services. Okay, let's accept this mission. Right, so we have to 
kill some guys. Some excavators. What? Invalid sheep for this quest. Oh man, I need a different kind of ship to complete this quest. Oh. Well, that's just stupid. Okay, so I can't do abide by the order because I need a different ship. Well, wow, that's really stupid. <laughs> um, yeah, I kind of came all this way, took two jump points, and I can't even do this rep reputation mission. Boy. So we're going to go back now to Samos. This is the only downside to this game. Starting jump into all these jump points. Can you imagine if you had a mission which is, say, 20 jump points away? Like, how do you even do it? Like, I guess the only way to logistically do it is to relocate your base to that system. But, you know, how do you even do that? Like, do you need, like, relocation tokens or something like that? I just don't know how to completely do that. And again, you know, I have questions about these yellow systems, like what does yellow mean? <laughs> I just don't know. Um, so yeah, so let's check back here. And we're just going back now. So I mean, can you take over these jump points? I wonder if you could take them over. Or whether they're just NPCs. Uh, okay, so we've just entered back into the Samos system here. Starting warp to the Samos station. And... Yeah, basically we couldn't do a reputation mission because we have the wrong kind of ship. Which is really unfortunate. I wish I'd tell you that beforehand. It is really annoying to have that. Okay. So... Just entering the Samos station now. And let's see what else we can do here because obviously we can't do that reputation mission. We can do that at a later stage. Oh, galaxy time. 1900 galaxy time. Entered space it is station. very late uh, in the galaxy. So they wanted. What did they want? This vigilante ship or the Link ship? Interesting. So, what else can I do here? Can you do this cutting edge technology mission? Hey, you are really like your father, kid. Hey, you are really like your father. Okay. Kid. Go on, take a look. Okay. So let's click here. Got some research things. Click on research. I know blood relationships. What is all this? We can do lies. ship research. NEF ship basics. Interesting. So you need to do all this research before you can unlock pilot licenses. Okay, so it takes 15 minutes. It's not too bad. Okay, so I've started that started that research. It's going to take 15 minutes. Not too bad at all. I think some of these research things could take a while. I know they do in Fleet Command. Okay. So, what have we got here? The damsel exploration. What is this exploration Hi, deal? Hi, we meet again. Hi, we meet again. Rare treasure, more complex. All right, so another tutorial. Let's check this out. The meaning of life is to adventure and explore. Interesting. So restore map data for its coordinates. Oh, it's like a little puzzle. That's awesome. Okay, rotate the sphere to align the holographics. Oh, okay. <laughs> that was pretty easy. I guess there's some some pretty hard ones out there. So click go, unlock the cavalry. And we're gonna do this mission now. So we unlock that little puzzle, and I assume it's going to take us to the area where the little puzzle is. Starting so we have to engine. go to the preen system. So luckily it's only one jump. Like, if this was 20, 25 jumps, like, I'm not sure if I would do this. Not sure if it's really worth it. So we're going to jump through this jump gate right now into the preen solar system.
All right, so we've just entered the Starting solar war system, action. commencing war. By the way, the graphics on this game are amazing. Commencing war. Okay, so we've just entered exploration. Oh wait, it's the stability of spatial rift. Interesting. So it's kind of like a timed thing. So we have to investigate this spatial rift. Hopefully we don't get sucked in. If this is anything like Star Trek, um, I don't want to be caught in an alternate reality, an alternate universe. So let's analyze the spatial rift. Exploring spatial rift. Cool. Engaged. Interesting. Oh yeah, pilot level up, level 13. Awesome. That is really good. Okay. So let's re turn to station. Target engaged. Starting warp engine. Wait, maybe I should have got more out of that spatial rift. Commencing. Oh god. Yeah, I probably clicked on the wrong thing. Okay, anyway. <laughs> That spatial rift is over, and now we're returning to Samos Space Station through the jump gate. And you know, we just completed this exploration mission. It was pretty good. We've got, I'm sure we got some pretty good items. I'm still not sure what the ceramics are for. Starting war. And engine. just entering Samos now. Commencing war. And yeah, there's lots of people here. Arrived. Enter in Samos Space location. Station. And this should be interesting. And yeah, that is pretty much it. I'm gonna leave it at that. So we got some cooperation points. Don't know why, but we just did. Um, I'm gonna leave it at that. Flight report, let's Enter see what we got here. Station. We got some ceramics. Nice. It's a blue level item, R3. Okay. Got some corp information, polymer, gel, component cases. Pretty good. All right. So don't forget to like and subscribe to my videos. All right. See you guys.